<laughs> Yo. <laughs> what up, everybody? <laughs> Carbo Moses. <laughs> and Abraham. <laughs> uh, we're going to be doing a little 2018 Donruss baseball. Half case number three eBay style. Case number three eBay style. Oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> ah. Ah. Uh, I need some sleeves though. Uh, I need some sleeves though. <laughs> All right. Uh. He likes to play rough sometimes, you know. He likes to play rough sometimes, yeah. All right, let me go ahead and re-up on my sleeve. All right, let me go ahead and re-up on my sleeve. You don't have to copy the noises the fucking sleeves make. You know that, right? You don't have to copy the noises the fucking sleeves make. You know that, right? <laughs> <laughs> All right. Now do your real job. Now do your real job. Good luck, everybody. Good luck, everybody. Good luck, everybody. Much better. My boy putting in that OT today. Oh, Mike, leave the poor dude alone. He's probably somewhere, you know. I don't know. <laughs> He's probably somewhere. What up, Big Jimmy? I see you over there on Breakers, my dude. How are you? Alright. I'm not going to bother taking all the boxes out. I'm just going to pick the first eight. Uno, dos, tres, cuatro, cinco, seis, siete, ocho. You just learned how to count to eight in Spanish. You're welcome. Uh. So let's move this to the side. All right, I'm going to be here a while. This is going to take a little minute, boy. Boy. Let me take a sip of this water because it's about to get hot. All righty, Kimasabi. Let's do this thing. All right. So who's in this break? Let yourselves be known. I see what you did there, Katie. I see what you did there. There you go, James. Now, uh, James, before I even open this, since you're the first to, to, to call your shot, okay, you got the Orioles. Who do you want to see come out and watch it happen? Kent has the Tigers. Call your shot. Be as specific as possible so that way when I do it, I look like a god. A Mancini Auto. I like it. Alan Trammell of the Tigers. I like it. Let it be done. And so it shall be. If I hit both of those, I'm going to go play the lottery or something. Uh, Hoku, pleasure to meet you. Glad you had fun. And uh, I hope to see you back soon. So you've seen a select bird and shack in the same box? Breaker Addiction? In the same box? That is cray cray. Get your back up off the wall.
I've never seen a Shaq autograph. I would love to see one. Get your back up off the wall. That song is stuck in my head now. Get down on it. Get down on it. It's a good song. It's a good song. How does he sign? Does he sign Shaq? Does he like do cursive? Does he do hieroglyphics? Like... Or does he sign it Shaquille O'Neal? I would love to meet Shaq. Just to see what it's like to, to look at a giant. And Shaq seems like a really cool dude, too. Like, like a dude that you could just, like, just chill with, hang out with. And, and if need be, he could put you on his shoulder and you could look over everybody. All right, here we go. All right, for the Braves, Ozzy Albies with the autograph. There you go. The chicken from San Diego. For the A's, Frankie Montas with the Pacheroni. Miguel Andujar, Yankees to 500. <sighs> oh, Breaker Addiction, I appreciate that. It's just a matter of time until people start to realize how cool I am. I don't know when that day is going to happen, but sometime soon, I hope. For the Indians, Corey Kluber to 149. For the Mariners of 301, Robinson can know. You already know. To 349, Carlos Correa, Astros. I just had a really sick thought. I'm like, yo, what if I become so huge one day that Dwayne Wade comes to the office and like does a break with me? Oh, that would be so amazing. I would probably faint if I ever met Dwayne Wade. I swear to God. I would, honestly, I've never been starstruck. Like, I've met a few athletes. But Dwayne Wade is probably one of those athletes that if I ever meet, I would probably faint. To 189, Aaron out there of the Phillies. I don't know. I was just randomly thinking. I'm like, man, what if, like, one day I'm so popular or whatever that, like, you know, I, I do... I do breaks co-starring athletes and shit. That would be so sick. Like one day, you guys come to the stream and I don't, you know, just randomly it's it's Dwayne Wade with an afro on pretending to be me. Like that would be the shit. Jake McCarthy to 349. That has to get random, the USA spot. We didn't sell a USA spot. We thought it'd be a lot more fun to just random them. Fuck it. Cooper Cup broke a box? Oh, that would be... Yeah, that would be sick, man. You know, have an athlete do a break with somebody? That would be so awesome. To 253, Mike Trout for the Angels. Let's 
see what we got. You know what's funny though? At the Nationals, we we had like uh at least for last year's national, we were trying to get Frank Thomas to do uh to do a baseball break with us, but it it would have just been way too much money to do it. That would have been cool as fuck though. To to do to do a break a baseball break with Frank Thomas, and Bates is a huge Frank Thomas fan. So he probably would have been squealing like a little girl doing a break with him. That would have been awesome, though. John Lamb to 99. Patch for the Angels. But I I, I just wanted to be like, oh, because I'm so cool. Like, athletes are, are banging on my door to do breaks with me. Like, little L2, he's like, yo, Uncle Jesse, can I do a break with you, bro? I'll be like, nah, bro, I'm kind of busy right now, dog. Please, I'm in your town. All right, Jose, come through, dog. To 999 for the Astros. Yo, a soccer break with Messi or Ronaldo would be, would be the tits. Alex Bregman, Astros to 199. I mean, Messi and Ronaldo would be cool. But I'd rather do it with this guy. The reason why I grow the fro, this dude right here, my dude, El Pibe. That's another dude that if I ever met, I would probably, like, faint. Like, see, I've never been starstruck before. And I've met some, like, kind of cool people in my life. But there's certain individuals that, like, I would faint. If I ever met Talia, I would probably faint, too. I had a huge crush on her growing up. If I ever met The Rock, I would probably faint. Because the fucking people's champion. If I ever met Allen Iverson, I would probably faint. Although, I've heard some really troubling things about him, but I'm not going to talk about that. I can't even... I, I don't know... I don't, I, I don't know who... I guess technically the most famous athlete I've ever met is Deion Sanders. But, like, how would you rate someone's... Fame. Like, that's probably the most famous athlete I've met, Deion Sanders. And I gotta say, guy's an asshole. So is Pete Rose. Met him before, too. Vin Diesel and Dwayne Wade have beef? The fuck? Yeah, I met Primetime before, but he's kind of an asshole. You know how they say you shouldn't you, you, you shouldn't meet your heroes because you're going to be disappointed? That's one of them. I was really disappointed when I met that guy. I tried to, ha you know, I tried to have like a conversation with him. You know, just, I even just said, hey, Mr. Sanders, you know, shook his hand, whatever. The guy was not even trying to give me the time of day. I was like, oh, whatever. Well, I mean, we took a picture together, which is cool. But, like, yeah, he, he ain't even trying to, like, have a combo with your boy. I gave him the benefit of the doubt because I'm sure people are always trying to, you know, kiss his ass and ask him for shit or blah, blah, blah. So he's probably just tired of it. But, like, damn, dude, like, you're prime time, dog. Like, I look up, you know, I used to fucking look up to you and shit. But you turn out to be an, a fucking dick. Even Pete Rose, like Pete Rose, I met Pete Rose, and he's known to be like a notorious dick face, and he was super cool. I spoke to him like a good for like a good five minutes. You met Eric Estrada, nice. 
from Chips. That's way before my time, but I know exactly what you're talking about. Poncherello. They should, I think they did try to remake that show. And it was an epic fail. Some things just deserve to be in the past. American Pride. I am a real American. Fight for the rights of every... All right, I'm not going to do the whole thing. Jake McCarthy to 249. Got a random that. I bet. He seems like a real cool dude. I've met a couple Miami Heat players, so I'm, I'm kind of happy about that. I met P.J. Brown. P.J. Brown is fucking the most cool dude ever. Like, seriously. Like, I, I talked to P.J. Brown for like a good 15, 20 minutes. I met him when I was 18. And, dude, super cool dude. Um, another Heat player I met. Uh, what's his name? Glenn Rice, bro. Met Glenn Rice before. That guy is the shit. That guy is awesome. That guy is awesome. I talked to him for like a good 15, 20 minutes, and he and it was like, it was like a, a full on like 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 he was talking to me like like a real human being. Like you look up to, you see these people on TV, and you know cause sometimes they don't seem real, but like it was surreal talking to Glenn Rice. Like that guy, legit, super cool human being. I mean, yeah, I mean, I don't know if. I don't know if P.J. Brown to you is like, you know, the P.J. Brown power forward for the Miami Heat. Well, he's also played for other teams, but. All right, so that Kershaw's to 999. But, yeah, you know, I met P.J. Brown at, uh, where was it? It was not on, it was not, it was at, it was at Universal Studios I met him. And I guess nobody really knew who he was. Of course, I knew who he was being a Heat fan. I grew up watching him, so you know. So I was really shy, at you know when I was eighteen, I was really shy. Believe it or not, at Aaron out there to four 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 Phillies. So when I seen him, I instantly recognized him. Oh, I was like, oh shit, that's P.J. Brown. And my mom's like, who? And she's like, and I'm like, yeah, that's P.J. Brown. You know, he's he's a fucking. He used to play for the Heat, dude. Like that guy's a that guy's a baller. And she's like, oh, you want his autograph? And I'm like, mom, you better not talk to him. Sure enough, my mom approaches him, and, like, she had, like, a good 10-minute conversation with the dude. Dude, yeah, P.J. Brown is one of the nicest guys I've ever met. Like, the guy took time to give me an autograph. We took we took a couple pictures, and he gave me, like, life advice and shit, too, like, which was really awesome, dude. P.J. Brown, one of the nicest people ever. Uh, to 268, Max Scherzer, uh, Nationals. I've probably said this before, but a dude that is super nice and a lot of people probably wouldn't expect it is uh, Latrell Sprewell. I met Latrell Sprewell, and that guy is cool as hell. Super cool. Super, I talked to that guy for like a good 15 minutes, too. That guy was super chill. Super cool. That guy's the man. Colin Ray Padres patch. Y'all know I met Lonzo Ball. That guy, that kid is super cool too. Cody Ballinger to 999. Dodgers. You know, pretty soon people are going to be like, oh my God, I met Cardboard Moses. That guy's a dick though. David Dahl, two color patch for the Rockies. So, P.J. Brown, didn't P.J. Brown play for the Hornets at some point too, Corey? I'm th I'm, I think, no, I think it's Jamal Mashburn I'm thinking of. Or it might be both of them, actually. I know for a fact Jamal Mashburn played for the played for the Hornets at one point. Rockies and Nolan Arenado to 199. I think P.J. Brown did play for the Hornets. There you go, Mike. <laughs> awesome, awesome. I'm, 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 I'm very, I'm strongly considering being him for, uh, for Halloween. 
Dylan Peters of the Marlins. My hair's not long enough, though. And I, I would need those tats. I'm not sure how I'm going to pull off the moving tats, but whatever. It's a 450 Dustin Fowler A's. I'm only on the second box of this. Jeez. All right. Let's, uh, let's get on task here, Uncle Jesse. Xander Bogerts to 199. How, how do you pronounce his name, seriously? For the Red Sox. Number 10 out of 99, Mike Trout for the Angels. I'm pretty sure he smashed that one. What else we got? For the A's, Dustin Fowler on a gray of Bogarts. Ah, well, I think I have been pronouncing it correctly then. There you go. All right. Two boxes down. Let's keep it going. Uh, do I see the Cavaliers and Clippers score? I do not. Where is it at? Where is it at? UNC and Duke. Duke uh, UNC is up by 12 on the Dukies. Damn, Villanova fucking destroyed Butler. Tell me about it, Breaker. I need that to number to zero. Portland is beating Golden State at halftime? Wow. Damn, Clippers! 54-37? With 420 left in the second quarter, giggity. Which reminds me, I got a little care package waiting for me. Which has been well deserved, man. I, I put in some hours this week, yo. Two releases this week. A few 13, 14 hour streams. I deserve a little some, some, some. I agree, Breaker. I agree. Just we just need people to join, and so so much for for thinking an optic inner case was gonna go faster than the. the I, I thought the master was gonna go quicker, if, but or whatever. I'm all fucked up right now. I can't even can't even think straight. You already know, Tomasi. You know the feds is watching. Feds is watching. So you gotta. Gotta keep it low key, you know what I'm saying? Damn, so the 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 Cavaliers are getting titty fucked by the Clippers right now. Lord of mercy. Thank you, Tomas. Thank you. I haven't played Monster Hunter all week, which is really sad for me. And depending on what time I get up out of here tonight, I may or may not play, <laughs> play some. I wish I had more select, honestly. But tomorrow, I am... Well, I mean, tomorrow, I, I, I do have breaks at 7. But I, I really want to get rid of some of the stuff we have in the store, so I'm, I'm likely going to be in, you know, around noon tomorrow as well. Montrell Harris was a beast in college. It was only a matter of time before he started bowling. He got a, he got a nice situation out there with uh, with Coach uh, Coach Rivers. The guy knows his basketball, man.
I like I love how Austin Rivers plays for his daddy. Cause he couldn't play anywhere else. Those Cavalier jerseys are ugly as hell. Uh, yes, the real 215. This is the eBay Donner's break. Correct. By the way, if you want to get into a full case break, check our website, ripcitycards.com. Register for an account. Save $15 off your first purchase, the real 215. Uh, nope, you have not. I am only on the third box. What else we got? Yon Mankata, White Sox to 199. What do we have here? Chris Sale to 999. Red Sox. Those are the ugliest jerseys ever. By the way, let me know if the stream starts to like lag. Because I kind of am watching basketball right now. <laughs> uh, Willie Calhoun, Rangers, autograph. Man, Larry Nance, where your free throws at, dog? The land. Ugly ass jerseys. How did they get those jerseys past LeBron? I bet LeBron was like, yeah, they're all right. see what we got we got Brian Dozier to 100 for the 2020 twins what are you apologizing for Mike you didn't apologize for nothing boy you didn't do nothing wrong but yeah as soon as the stream starts to lag let me know I'll, sh I'll shut the I'll shut it down I don't really care. I just I just love watching basketball. I should be watching the Warrior game. That game is a lot closer. I can't help myself. Basketball is my favorite sport, dude. Like I could legit watch any like basketball at any, well not at any level, but college basketball amazing. Because those kids leave it all out there, day in, game in, game out. Pros, eh, but for the most part, yeah. Brian Johnson, Red Sox patch. I love watching the Heat. Heat basketball, baby. To 249, Clayton Kershaw, Dodgers. Nobody's playing for the Warriors? Who are they, who are they sitting down? I know Curry's hurt right now. He got that right ankle sprain. I don't know exactly how, how hurt he is, but I know he's hurt. Eric Hosmer, Royals patch. Mickey Mantle to 349 for the Yankees. That's pretty sweet. All right, we need to hit some big autos. Come on now. We got Adam Frazier of the Pirates with the patch auto. Very nice. Damn, who's that chick? Oh, dang, that was a damn. Well, you guys probably can't see it. I'm watching the, uh, the live feed from the Clippers arena. But, damn, they got some hot. Well, that is L.A. That is L.A. So, I got I to gotta take that into consideration. They got some cutie patooties out there, boy. To 199, Willie Calhoun, Rangers. 5640, Lakers, uh, Lakers, Clippers up on the Cavs. Oh, Cavaliers. LeBron must be, like, really pissed. The Reds, Joey Votto to 49. Both are twins there. Of 
Cody Bellinger to 352 for the Dodgers. DeAndre Jordan making his free throws? What? Well, he is he does shoot like 40-50%, so he's going to make the free. He made the first one. He's about to airball this second one. Cal Ripken to 431 for the Orioles. Yeah, he bricked the second one. <laughs> uh, but they should just shoot free throws like Rick Barry style. Tyler Holton to 999 USA. Got a random dose. All right. Box three down. I'm trying to hit you the main chinis, Massey. I ain't forget about you, James. I ain't forget about you. I got you the real 215. It's not up to me, though. It's up to the cardboard gods. Did, did you guys make your sacrifices to the cardboard gods? You know what would increase your chances of getting a hit, though? Uh, if you did this. If you went to RipCityCards.com. Clicked login, then register, and fill all that information out so we can email you a $15 off code so you can join our breaks and uh, and help fill all this lovely stuff we have. Come on, peeps. Let's do it. Oh, well, see, there's the problem, the, the real 215. You, you, paid, you paid it for Cardboard Jesus, but... I'm Cardboard Moses. Two different disciples, my good sir. Two different disciples. So increase your chances. Go to RipCityCards.com and pick up a team. Dang it. I'm giving away Donruss boxes. Once PYT fills for Donruss, I'm going to give away two boxes to someone. So one person could potentially pick up two. But I am giving away two Donruss boxes once the PYT is full. Same thing with Heritage. Ah, gotcha, the real 215. You just never said anything. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. It's all good. Cardboard Judas. We don't talk about Cardboard Judas. That We don't talk about him. He's like Voldemort, you know? He whose name shall not be spoken. Gotcha, two one five. I forgot who gave me that name, Cardboard Moses. I think it was Jason himself that they called me the Cardboard Moses. Nice pass. J.R. Smith takes the dumbest shots ever. But he be making them sometimes. Alright, box four. Here we go. I need the hotness. I need the hotness. I need the hotness. 
Devin Marrero for the Red Sox patch. All right. Corey Kluber to 999 Indians. Hmm. Yeah, speaking of, JR just hit a stupid crazy three. Brandon Shipley of the Diamondbacks with the patch auto. Boom. J.R. Smith's a funny dude. Like, he has so much talent. But he refuses to, like, really do anything with it. To 49, Ryan McMahon, Rockies. He could have been, a, like, a way better player if he ever just... I don't know, man. I don't think he ever had, like, a really good coach in his career to be like, Hey, dude, stop taking fucking fadeaway threes from 30 feet away. You're super athletic. Get to the cup. He has a decent handle too. But he be taking he just he has really I think in my opinion low basketball like you. But he be but he be making shots, man. You gotta give credit where credit is due. Tobias Harris, time to ball out. For the Milwaukee Brewers, Brandon Woodruff, the auto. No, I agree. He's incredibly talented, for sure. Super athletic. Can still jump out the gym. But, like, yeah, I don't know, man. He's, he's kind of an enigma. Would be the best word I can use to describe him. He's an enigma. Corey Seager of the Dodgers of the patch. Corey Seager, Dodgers to 999. Mariners to 99, Nelson Cruz. Uh, no, GP Collector. This is an eBay break. We have franchise leaders to 199. Rod Carew and Harmon Kilbrew of the Twins. Sendarius Thornwell. Isn't he a rookie? And that dude shooting four for five from the field, 11 points. There you go, Rook. Get your buckets, my dude. Man, deep, deep rookie class. Although, I don't think Sendarius is a rookie. I think he was a rookie last year. I don't know. I'd be forgetting. A. a Ron Judge. To 500 for the Yankees. Now see the, these boys, we got a random, and I'm sure I missed more more than one, but that's fine. There's only one card of these as far like as far as with multiple players. It's always two players, so the random for this will be easy. It's either gonna go to the top team or the bottom team. We'll do that at the end. For the Marlins to 99, Giancarlo Stanton. Little gold mojo. Oh, yeah. They're back from... That's what. That's the game I really want to watch. The Blazers-Warriors game so I can watch my dude. My boy. My hitter. Dame Dalla. Favorite player in the league right now. Braden Shoemake to 99. I 
I need that Rip City jersey. I need that. It's getting to the point where, like, it's not that I want it. I need it. I need it. I need that Rip City jersey. And I'm wearing it every single day. So if anybody wants to make that donation, you know, that'd be nice. All right. Let's see what we got. Man, a lot of golds in this box. The 99 Mookie Betts of the Red Sox. Okay, so. That. Are you serious, Tomas? Shit, that Excel, dog. Halfway through. Let's make it do what it do. I really want is that uh that Vice City Dwayne Wade jersey. But that shit is sold out everywhere, man. Can't buy you can't even buy them off the Heat website. They're fucking sold out everywhere. Maybe if I go to the arena, I could, I could probably get one. Tomas, if you did that, bro, I would, like, give you a fucking handy at the National, dog. Not me, but I'll pay for someone to do it. I'll pay for Julie to do it, all right? Make Pappy jealous. Well, Kevin Durant is playing for the Warriors. What jerseys they got on right now? Are those throwbacks or, or, or are those the uh, the city? Oh, man, and the Blazers are wearing the Rip City jerseys. Oh, wow. They just they just happen to, to be wearing the Rip City jerseys. Are those the city, uh, the town jerseys or whatever for, for the Warriors? Uh, Ray, after this, uh, do, I'm take. I'll take it, Jason. Uh, after this, I have Grand Reserve basketball scheduled for midnight. But at this rate, it's probably gonna start a little bit later. KD just makes it look super easy. Dame Dalla, what you gonna do, dog? Cook him, cook him. That's not a foul. Call the foul, man. How you gonna hit my boy Dame Dalla like that, man? Come on, man. <coughs> Come on, Clay. You're a great defender, but you can't stick Dame Dollar like that, bro. This ain't the 90s. Oh, and Tomas, if the if it could be like a custom jersey, so that it says like cardboard Moses or Moses on the back, with the number one on it, because you know I'm number one, that'd be awesome. That's fine, Jason. Oh, she's gonna get all kinds of paper cuts. Zach Collins with a boo boo. Oh, that's a that's a Charlie horse. He got a Charlie horse. Damn, Zach Collins is long as hell. But the rookies get minutes. Awesome. I think is he starting for? I don't think he's starting for the Blazers, but. Oh, dude, I'll have Abraham on the entire time. Live streaming on Instagram. For the Twins, Felix Jorge. Autograph for the 2020 Twins. Let 
Need to heat this thing up. Come on. It's been a bit. Uh. To, two, to 231, Clayton Kershaw Dodgers. To 500, Eddie Matthews Brewers. Steve Kerr, I, I hope you're giving like half your salary to, uh, to what's his name? I forget, who was the coach of the Warriors before Steve Kerr, who pretty much put, put that entire team together? And then Steve Kerr was like, oh, okay, championship time now. Mark Jackson? Yeah. I hope he's giving like half his salary to Mark Jackson year in, year out. Luke Jackson for the Braves. To 999, Carlos Correa, Astros. Marcelo Zuna for the Cardinals to 999. Blue Jays or Phillies, you have been summoned. Like, been, been summoned. So, it, it, it's time to show. Time to show a little ink for my boy. To 390, George Brett, Royals. Evan Turner still in the league? LOL. Uh, those are both reds. Right? Yes. For the twins, the 25, Miguel said no. Yeah, no. Man, Warriors are putting to are putting it to the Blazers right now. Dame Dollar, do what you do. Trey Turner to 349. Nationals. You know, Evan Turner doing the damn thing. Kevin Durant. Starting to heat up. That guy's a cheat code. Jose Ramirez of the Indians autograph to 99. Boom. Jose Ramirez to go along with his auto. A little napkin for the Indians. All right. The Honey Badger going to the Redskins? Jose Ramirez to 345 Indians. I thought you were going to say the Browns, man, because they've been making moves all day. I hope that friend, I hope the city of Cleveland can get a football team again, man. They're, they're a great sports town. LOL. Mike Trout to 189 for the Angels. American Pride of Jeremy Airman. That was number 2999. All right, two different players on this. We're going to have to random it. It'll either go to the top or bottom team. 
And I'm sure I've passed a few others, but no worries. There's only inserts with two players on them top, so. It's either going to go to the top or bottom team on the back of the card. Honestly, I would not be surprised if Richard Sherman ended up with, like, the Rams or maybe even the Eagles or, like, the Patriots. But he's definitely going to sign with, like, a contender. Even if he's going to take a pay cut, going to sign with a contender. Need more top loaders. Portland with the taking the lead here. They also have Tyrod Taylor at quarterback now, Jarvis Landry at wide receiver, who's pretty much sure hands a guaranteed first down if you need one. Browns might make some noise. Browns might make some noise. Wow, Sean Livingston just fouled Dame Dollar shooting a three. What an idiot. <laughs> ah, Sean Livingston, come on, dog. Tell me about it, Jeremy. I'm not sure if you're trolling me, but you are absolutely right. It is going to be fire. Sherman with the Raiders? Going to meet up with... Uh, Dang, what's his name again? Coach Chucky? Coach uh, Gruder? Gruden? Whatever the fuck. Of course, Jeremy, the power of the pen. I think there's two two episodes again left. There's tomorrow's episode. John Gruden. I said Gruder or something. I don't know. Whoa, chill. Coach Gruden, I mean, I don't know. We shall see. Shall see. How crazy was the parade, 215? I know they had free beers, dilly dilly. I, I'm not even an Eagles fan, and I wish I was on on Broad Street. I would have I would have been on one of the uh, on one of the light poles. I bet, yo, I'm surprised they did not like fuck the city up completely. Awesome for the Eagles, man. Awesome for the Eagles. But now you're not going to shut up Philly fans for a while. All right. Let's uh, see what we got here. <clears throat> for the A's, Paul Blackburn, the autograph. I just want to see one Dolphins Super Bowl. Just one. Just one. I'm not asking for much. I'm not asking for much, football gods. I just, I just want one 
in my lifetime. I don't care if I'm like in my on my deathbed and I see it. Just just want to see one. I bet the real two one five, dude. I seen. I was watching videos of like fans eating shit, eating literal shit. What's that about? Jorge Lopez of the Brewers. Uh, Rudy, what up, man? Uh, I do have a filler for Heritage. That is the closest thing I have to breaking. It's a 13 spot filler. I am giving away two Heritage boxes once the PYT is full. $37 for a random team. 13 spots in the filler for Heritage. To 99, Jose Ramirez Indians. Who's that? For the Dodgers, Corey Seager with a patch. Max Scherzer, Nationals to 999. It's going to be cold as tits when I get out of here tonight. Dude, I, I am I know you cried. I know for a fact you cried when the when the Eagles won their 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 Super Bowl. I, I dude when the Heat won, I cried. Well, the first time anyway, I cried, bro. Tears of just pure joy with, with our with our first franchise uh, championship. If the Dolphins ever win. Oh my God! The the joy that is gonna come through my body. I don't know. Robbie Ray there, D backs. I felt like top loading it. So what? It's gonna get top loaded anyway. All right, what else we got? Oh, see these got three different teams, so. And I have to random that to somebody. Puerto Rico's finest. If the if bro, if Ryan Tannehill led the Dolphins to a Super Bowl, I would name my first child after Ryan Tannehill. Even if it was a girl, boy or girl, I don't care. First name Ryan, middle name Tannehill, my last name. Boom. To 500, Ken Griffey Jr. of the Mariners. When the Marlins won their first championship, I cried in 97. And when they won in 2003, I was like, whatever. But I was super happy. But yeah, when the Marlins won their first championship, their first World Series, I cried. Back in 97. I was like six, seven years old. When the Heat won it. In 2006, I cried like a little bitch. I was like 16, 17 years old. And when the Dolphins win their first championship, it's in my dreams at this point. Alright, I'm starting to notice a little bit of a lag, so I'm going to shut that down. Probably going to have to random that one too. Yes, sir. For the White Sox... Nikki Delmonico, the auto. Boom. Put it out there to make it happen. Man, the a, a lot of things have to go our way for the for the Dolphins to win the Super Bowl. First off, first off, Tom Brady needs to, like, retire or just not play. But a, a lot has to happen. Bryce Tucker to 999. American Pride, that will be random. Are you serious, Choking Chickens? That is awesome. Damn, Breaker Addiction. That's how I know it's probably not going to happen. <laughs> ah, I'm not even, that's not even funny. Oh, 
My tooth is starting to act up. Oh, jeez. No, James. The Dolphins cursed themselves. The Dolphins cursed themselves. As long as Mike Tannenbaum is our general manager, we're cursed. As long as our owner is Steven Ross, we're cursed. It's not me. It's a 101 Marcus Lynn Betts. Or Mookie Betts for the Red Sox. He got a tricky Nicky tattoo under his nips. That is hilarious. Mookie Betts, Red Sox to 199. Two boxes left. Need some mojo. Need some mojo. After this, you're right. Big Dick Nick. Yo, that dude called that Philly Philly call. Legendary. Legendary Nick Foles. Grand Reserve. Basketball's coming up after this break, you guys. So stay tuned. Optic is still at 24. Come on, y'all. Heritage at 12. Donruss at 18. Come on, guys. Come on. Seriously. I'm giving away two boxes in the Heritage break, and I'm giving away two boxes in the Donruss break. What more do you guys want from me? Seriously. I don't, even, I don't have to do that, but I'm doing it. Philly's mojo coming your way. Orioles mojo on the way. the hotness Phillies and Orioles have made a request come on now Braves doing work though Lucas Sims for the Braves to 353 Benintendi Red Sox Five hundred, Mike Trout, Angels. Come 
Herman Marquez to color patch for the Rockies. Nolan Arenado, Rockies to 249. Miguel Sano with the Twins with the two color patch. To 349, Altuve, Astros. Got to random that. Oh boy, Tomas. Ah, so much pressure. Phillies and Orioles come out to play. Auto style. Come on. Come on, come on. Alan Trammell, Trey Mancini, I have summoned you. Come out to play. You Darvish to 189, Dodgers. There you go, Christian. Always listen to Cardboard Moses. To 999, Mike Trout, Angels. What up, Mike Corona? Well, dude, I have Heritage Baseball that I've been trying to rip. Optic cont uh, Contenders Optic Football as well. Donruss Baseball. Any, any of that sound uh, sound interesting to you? Casey Mice, the 999, USA. Dude, my butt is numb. Been sitting on my ass for like the last 12 hours. How long, is that? I think that's how long I've been streaming. About 12 hours or so? Oh, 10 hours. Close to 11. <sighs> Gonna have to random that. For the Rockies, Ryan McMahon. 8 out of 10, the autograph on that. That's pretty sweet. Uh, Christian, uh... Is uh is Larry Bird good? Cause I hit that. Green too to 65. Is Carmelo good? I hit him to 25. Donovan Mitchell hit him twice to 25. Uh Dennis Smith Jr. hit him twice too. What about Jason Tatum? Hit him as well. Lonzo Ball, yeah, I hit that too. Yeah, it's, it's, I've had. I, I select was good to me. To two seventy nine, Bellinger of the Dodgers. Uh, Phillies and Heritage are indeed available. They are indeed available, my Corona. And if you've never, well, no, actually, a lot. You have made purchases on the website. And dude, I'm giving away two Heritage boxes in that break. So buy a team and you're in, straight up. I don't know too many breakers that do things like that. So take advantage, people. Before Jason comes in and is like, what? He's doing that? Nah, fuck that. Take advantage, people. So yeah, Christian. Select basketball was very good to me. What about you, man? You had anything nice in, uh, in select? I'm all sold out of it. That's how nice it was. All sold out. Tell me about a breaker addiction. Tell me about it. Whoa.
Last box mojo. Come on now. Oh yeah, I forgot. Yeah, I know I have been streaming for longer than 12 hours. I forgot the uh, X split crashed on me when I was doing PYT1. So yes, I, I have actually been live for over 12 hours. Grand Reserve is coming up right after this. There you go, Tomas. Money being made, baby. To 500, Jose Abreu. White Sox. Come on, Phillies and Orioles. Come on. White Sox, Rinaldo Lopez patch. Giancarlo, 10.99 for the Marlins. Francisco Lindor to 3.49 Indians. Nice. Two out of five for the Braves. Wow, Braves killed this half of the case. Luis Gohara, two out of five. That is nice. To 349, Logan Morrison of the Rays. Dwight Gooden of the Mets with an autograph. Archie Bradley patch for the D-backs. What do we have here? 29, the Astro Heavy Hitters. Correa and Altuve. Patrick Ravens to 349, USA. Got a random that.
for the Cubs, Chris Bryant to 249. That's probably going to be it. Sorry, Phillies, Orioles, and everybody else that did not hit. To 261, Evan Longoria, Giants. And that's the break. Now, we do have a few things to random. But that's going to be super easy. So there's some cards with two players on them. Let me go ahead and uh, pull them out. Alright, so. I'm going to roll the die for them. If I get an even number top, odd number bottom. Even top, odd bottom. Even top, odd bottom. Here we go. Even top. So it's going to go to the top team. So we have Cardinals, Marlins, Twins, Cardinals, Twins, Twins. Make a note of it. And let's also roll the die. For these, the Puerto Rico's finest. It's all the same. Got three teams, though. Three different teams. So, got a six-sided die, die here. If I roll the number one or two, goes to the top. Three and four, middle. Five and six, the last spot. Here we go. Got the number four, which means... Going to the middle. Cardinals. There you go, little Yaddy Air. You're welcome, James. Sorry I couldn't get you any any good stuff, my dude. Same with you, Real215, man. I'm sorry, bro. Alright, let's recap the autos. So we have... Oh, I also have to random this. I'm tripping. Check out our your store breaks too, uh, James. RipCityCards.com. We got some nice stuff on there too, man. Not just eBay. All right. So I'm going to have to grab these baseball teams because we got to random these USA uh, inserts here. I'm glad you are super cool about it, James. But uh, one of these days, the gamble's going to pay off huge, my man. All right. So let's roll die and see how many times we're going to go in this stuff. We're going to go four times in the random for the USA cards. There's the random, four times. Boom! Went four times, Cubs at the top of the list. So Cubs will be receiving all the American Pride cards. Let's re recap the autos. So we have Gooden Mets, McMahon Rockies, Sims Braves, Delmonico White Sox, Blackburn A's, Ramirez Indians, Jorge Minnesota, Woodruff Brewers, uh, Shipley Diamondbacks, Frazier Pirates, Calhoun Rangers, Fowler A's, Peters Marlins, and Albies Braves. And that was the break. 20.